Welcome back, heroes, to some more Pokemon Bazaar. Last episode, so much happened. So we saw that ACP now has Hooper. They managed to uh, summon it, and they've got the Prison Bottle as well, which is not good. Missile, the robot that we defeated before, is like fused with like the Pharaoh's body, and it's just like super strong now. Had to escape from that. We had to wait for a bunch of ice puzzles. Got up to the hot springs, and we saw Samira asking, I think an Elite Four member for some training, which um, is not good because Samira's uh, she's a little bit tough, and obviously getting some training from the Elite Four members can make her even stronger. And then we saw the uh, like the the cowboy dude on the on Tauros just get teleported here through a hooper hole and he's like uh what how did I end up here and now he's you know obviously uh gone back home well trying to go back home anyway so now we're going to keep heading east and we're going to make our way to a sugar hill town but the cold of the area helps me to concentrate it's not as good material for psychics oh didn't know that wait I'm not talking about that kind of snow oh okay um the snow in this area generates so many problems couldn't anyone everyone just move to I don't know Despacito town anyway I should have become a baker <laughs> So random. Right, Route 11. Let's see if we can find some great Pokemon around here. Is there like any ice psychic Pokemon? They're probably, oh yeah, Jinx, there you go. I was gonna say, I'll tell you how, right now, I can't think of one. I think this is ice psychic, um, but like uh, an official Pokemon, but bam, straight away, Jinx. Okay, uh, we are gonna go for a fun, oh, you're gonna switch to a Bomber Snow. Right, we should definitely switch. If we go for, Orbitorpedo, we can switch both out. Bring that bad boy out, and I'm gonna go into. Let's go to Spiritomb. I do like the Spiritomb, it's pretty sick. Let's go Flame Burst. Although, what, maybe Dark Pulse. Maybe, no, maybe Shadow Ball, actually, because you're Psychic Ice. Still, these things are tough. Ah, oh, an Aurora Veil. Oh, great, that's gonna make things even tougher. I need the special defense drop from Shadow Ball. And then we're good, but I'm just not getting it. Oh, this Orange Guru is so tough. Just keep Shadow Balling, we'll eventually win. <laughs> and then when the Bomber Snow comes out, we just Flame Burst it and we're good. I hope. Another Aurora Veil, great. <laughs> oh, I think I have some potions I can use after this, because there wasn't a, um, as far as I know, there wasn't a place to heal up in the hot springs. I, I spoke to the people inside the building didn't heal me up so I flew back to a town to get healed up for this episode. Right, Bomber Snow, just don't outspeed me we sure you outspeed me. Oh, that sucks. Ready for Spiritomb would outspeed it. Bomber Snow. Uh, what should we go for? I think Accordion should be fine. And we've got Hyper Voice. And then you fall oh, that, okay. It's because he freeze me, I can't believe that. And then luckily, oh, we broke out, but damn, that was, this fight. So tough. Got one more hyper voice. There we go, man. Starting the episode off with a very difficult fight. That probably should not have been that difficult. Ice beam. Uh. Mm, I'll get rid of Thunder Wave. I'll be honest, like the special, like signature move for the starter. I'm not. Okay then, <laughs> nature. Um. Yeah, I'm not the biggest, not the biggest fan of it. Oh, we can walk across this. Not the biggest fan of it. If you guys know what the um, the fire and grass starters are, do let me know. Like their signature ability. Is it better? I mean, I assume it's probably going to be a little bit better. But uh, I'm going to lead off with the spirit and quickly revive it. And then we can hopefully have a good time flame burst and stuff. If I can learn like flamethrower or like a stronger move, that would be so sick. I'm not wasting a max revive. Do I have a normal revive? Got one normal revive. Okay. Go for the potion. We have. Let's go for the hyper. There we go. Back to full HP. Now let's continue exploring. Uh, yo! Voltsy, the great rising star. Come so I can test you. Okay, how do you know my name? Who are you? <laughs> oh, it's a headhunter, that's why. Oh, Mammoth Swine's probably not the best Pokemon to fight right now. Yeah, I have Quake. Oh, I just live! Okay, uh, let's switch. I'm gonna go Crobat in case you try to go for another Earthquake. Nope, you're going for Blizzard. Oh, great. Great. <laughs> well, that's not good. Here we get the flinch. Nope. Man, I was really hoping you'd go for Earthquake. Oh, man. Alright, uh... Let's go Cordion and we'll just Hyper Voice. And we miss. Great. Man, I've always with these battles today. They are very tough. I thought my team maybe like... I don't know. Ice to the ice Pokemon around here shouldn't be too difficult to beat, but we're getting absolutely wrecked. Uh, 
Metacham. We yeah, probably should switch out. Alright, let's go Cosmolander, and then we'll go for like a Scold. Burn it. Burn it. Ooh, counter. Nice. So that's, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. Licky licky. Yeah, uh, we'll stay in. Oh, we got the burn there. There you go. <laughs> gonna fail the me first. We're gonna keep scolding and then. Oh, okay. You're gonna heal the burn. I mean, it's fine because the next attack takes you out anyway, but. Right, how do I get to this? I need... Do we rock climb? I don't remember if we do, but I see. I see. I call this trick failing out life. <laughs> Alright then. Also, I need to check the achievements, make sure that we haven't missed anything. And I should have healed up. That's fine. Who can finish you off? Cosmo Man has got this. Oh no, wrong one. That's fine. We bring it out. Pass me in. Uh. I, I, you got to be ice fighting, right? If you want ice psychics, maybe fairy fish should be good here. Or not. Okay, you are not ice fighting. I'm gonna U-turn out. Just so I don't die. <laughs> uh, some floor will definitely die if I go in there. I'm just really hoping this right now this route is not that long and we can just... Oh. Okay. Uh, that's not good. Nice right, Thunderbolt. Yeah, hoping this route isn't that long. We can just get to Sugar Hill Town and just go from there. Whew. Oh, I need to get a um, Heracross as well, back from the, the ruins from last episode, because someone said I'm going to need it for a side quest. So we need uh, got the, got the Hose, a Neon Stone, and the Heracross. Oh, so we got the, well, I think we have a Neon Stone. I'm fairly certain I picked up another one. Just double checking. So obviously we use one to get our accordion. Yeah, neon stone. So we got one. That's good. Yeah, I do have rock climbs. We're gonna, um, did the big long, <laughs> long talky side quest. That just the dude would not shut up. All right, I need to go over that. I got TM. All right, well, what have we got here? Any new Pokemon? Metacham? No thanks. Just gonna run. Please be good. Frostbeth. Okay, that's not, it's not the worst. Is this Sugar Hill? Please say it is. These kids nowadays can't even relax at home anymore. In the end, I'm much calmer here with this music. It's alright music. Hey, Sugar Hill Town. Alright. Got the DDB. We'll go explore this as much as possible and then uh, see what we can do. All right, let's get healed up first though, 100% because we, uh, yeah, got a bit wrecked. All right, so uh, let's go and speak to you. For these young people today, they're making the town quite colorful to be honest. All this snow eventually gets boring. Why did it make so much noise? Uh, yo, how's it going? All this cold is freezing my brain. Do you think I can make frozen dessert my brain? <laughs> so what do you think it would taste like? Sure, there must be an audience interest in a product like that. Even if they are zombies. <laughs> okay, then. Um, my daughter spends too much time away from home. Well, I guess I have more time alone with my husband. Went for that, the fact that he uh, went to go buy some smokes. Oh, yeah, he's never coming back. Yeah, how it goes. We get a pack of smokes and never come and pay. This is a restricted area. Please leave. Okay, then. Hey, I'm the only one who can break in other people's houses here. So you can go back to where you came from. Okay, then. Right. A witness protection house look like a little bit. Uh, yo. So good morning, you great soul. Listen, I have something to tell you. Oh. Bazinga! <laughs> I'm alright, okay. Right then. <laughs> uh, what else have we got around here? Uh, anything in the trash? Nope. Uh, so check that out. Why are you spinning on your head? I made a bet with him to see how long he could keep spinning on his head. It's been like this for a week. Good for you. So I'm 19 years old and I've already wasted my whole life. I guess I can, I don't know, sell tacos or something. Uh, you're gonna have some tough competition with Waluigi now. Oh, is that Joshua? Apes, hey, faulty. Are those idiots the leaders here? Looks like they're setting up something here in the plaza. They look weird. Almost as weird as you do. Wait, oh, God, wow, thanks friend. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, Emanesia is ready to drop the bars. 
who dares challenge this, uh, Kikeda? Oh wow, what a surprise. Looks like we have some new prey. You have the, uh, face of a beast. I think she's challenging you. Go on, Volti. Give her what she deserves. Nobody backs down from a battle here. Alright, are you ready to feel the flow? Uh, oh, fine. I don't want to do this. Oh, ho, I can feel the flow already. Let's warm up our engines. I'm activating my senses. Come on, uh, Dogen, set the pace. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Emanesia arrives to set the pace. The rookie has arrived to get put in an asylum. The Queen of Sugar Hill burns to the beat. I combust you with my sizzling heat. Uh, talk about her mother, talk about the weather, talk about turtles. Uh, I don't know. So I picked up your mum with a well-planned gambit. It was a beautiful night. She blew out the candle to make it more romantic. No doubt that woman was totally magical. What appears she has a daughter who is so pitiful. Oh! Ho -ho. Are you kidding me? I think what happened is that uh, you can't assimilate. You're such an ill-faced snake. Your mother kicked you out of the house for playing FIFA all day. I mean, that's kind of true. Talk about your hat, talk about your rhythm, talk about movies. Rhythm. You claim to be the hottest, but only Hochata flows through that flow. At this rate, I'm going to run out of contenders, because with that pace, the battle will be over already. Okay, look at this hippie trying to participate. You've got a lot of uh, blowout attitude. You feel the weight of my rhymes on your spine. Blow after blow, you're not going to recover. Give the stage dude is hurting you mentally. Uh, talk about Minecraft. <laughs> I'm going Minecraft. You're a pro and your rhymes are square. Mine explode like a creeper in Minecraft. My rhymes are diamond, yours are wet wood. If you don't keep up with me, you'll last less than a spent gold shovel. Oh, well, your mum can't. Oh, not bad, not bad. Guess we can wrap things up for now. So, Volsi, right? I'm sure you move as well in battle as you do rapping. Are you here for a gym badge? Uh, Dogen and I will be ready for a fight. Dogen, anything to comment? Yeah, wise words. As deep as ever. Come on, we've got to prepare. Let's go with the flow. Okay then, wow, Volsi, for your first time, you really held your own in that rap battle. I would never have uh, thought you had such hidden talent. Well, I'm going to explore the area a bit, and I'll challenge the leaders later. These guys are masters in double battles. Well, I guess I have to prepare well. I'll tell you one thing I actually really like. Like, I've had it done in a few fan games before. I love when you go and fight the, the gym leaders who are double battles, and like, you team, it with your, team up with your rival. Because like, double battles for gym leaders, it, it's cool. But I feel like it's a little bit more difficult when you have like your um, your rival teaming up with you because you don't know what they're gonna do, and sometimes they can like be. I mean, sometimes they can carry you, and sometimes they can just uh, drag you down. I have a special brownie recipe, but it's not suitable for children. Better not tell too many people about this. Okay, wait, I should need a check before I forget. Uh, we press F. So what are we missing? So I need to do the King of the River still. Discover the mystery of Mikolash Island. Okay, so I need to do two side quests then we've missed. That are somewhere, but we can obviously look around at some point. We've got a bar here. Oh. Oh, Volta, you're here. Come on, we're at the table in the back. Oh, hey. I found our manager at the entrance. Oh, Volta, how's it going? Look, we've come to see a pianist. We heard that there was a great foreign pianist in the region. Yeah man, and we finally found her. She better be good. Took a long time to get here and it's freezing cold. Well, she's gonna start now. <laughs> Cynthia's music. Hey, doesn't she remind you of the Sinnoh champion? Yeah, she's our cousin. Really? No, I just made it up. Ah, <laughs> let her play. I should learn how to play that actually. That'd be a really good song to learn. But I've been listening to you. You're not wrong. I am her cousin. What, really? Man, Melina, you really know everyone. <laughs> My name is Paloma. Uh, thank you for coming to listen to me. It was impressive. Not bad. Wow, you're so cool. Oh, thank you. This is the first day that so many people have come to see me. I've been staying in town for a few days because I'm traveling through Quintellus. But I just saw this piano and fell in love. Paloma, I heard how cool you were in Queen City and that's why we've uh, come to see you. We're called The Soundless. We're putting together a cool music band. Oh, and I sense that you have come to ask me to join your group? How did you- Yeah, it was exactly that. She's a smart girl. Ah, it's not the first time I've been asked. So, would you like to? It's true that it would give me a good opportunity to travel. 
Still, I didn't come to play. I came to fight. I'm a trainer. Ah, well, look, we have someone who's very strong. Oh, you're a trainer too? He's Voltsy, our manager. He's not bad. Well, how about this? If you beat me, I'll join you. Come on, come on, Voltsy, come on, come on. Well, let's get to it. All right, let's do it. Being seen is like she's as strong as Cynthia. <laughs> oh, level 59 Togekiss. Okay, it's, I'm not gonna lie, a little scary. Um, I'm gonna switch into Cosmomanda. That's fine, then we'll go for a Thunderbolt. Nice, not bad, not bad. Yeah, you ain't outspeeding me, so no flinches. Oh, you're definitely gonna have like Cynthia's team, aren't you? Let's go for Ice Beam and you outspeed me. Luckily, we'll go for a Grass type move. Oh, if, you, if I outsped you, that'd be so much better. Um, I'm gonna go Crobat. Surely you don't outspeed my Crobat, nice. I might have to fully heal Cosmo Amanda for the Ice Beam on the Garchomp when it comes. Yeah, there's the Garchomp. Right. Uh, although we got Fairy Fist, so Letty, and I can go for that. Fairy Fists. Oh, of course we miss. <laughs> nice. Nice. One more hit. Hey, that's fighting too bad. Not bad at all. Toga Kiss. Uh, we'll. Yeah, we outspeed it, don't we? So we'll go for Thunderbolt. Nice, nice, nice. Three down. Is there three more to go? What, Lucario, Gastrodon, and then one more I can't think of. Absol? Does Cynthia usually have an Absol? Don't remember. I'll go for a, go to Accordion for this. It's getting a little bit weak. Oh, you're gonna sucker punch me, you suck. <laughs> okay, that's good. She haven't come one shot yet, but still nice. Zoomerill. Uh, if we outspeed you, actually no, let's go Sunflora. I was gonna go for a Thunderbolt, but we'll go. Let's go for a Quiver Dance because I don't think you're gonna do too. Yeah, do too much to me. And then Giga Drain. <laughs> All right, last one. If it's Gastrodon or Lucar or Gallade, uh, you know what? I'll stay in. Go Moonblast. Gonna protect, of course you are. You're gonna false swipe me, sure. You wanna keep going false swipe? I do not mind. There we go, nice and easy. Hmm. Easy, dude, wow, you're really strong. My cousin would like you. Well, Palombina, do you wanna join us? Well, it might be fun, why not? Perfect, Voltsy, another job well done. Well, gang, we're off to a Maiden Islan, okay. Where is that? Let's check the map. That's probably gonna be south. Cable car takes us, got fer Ferry Bay, it's got Surf Club. Yes, Islands, okay. Uh, Maiden Island. Te uh, Technomantic, uh, Technomantic Club. The train looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun. Bar Snoopy and then NASA. <laughs> Mikolaj Islands. We've got to try and find a way here. For that side quest, right? Oh, there's a boat. Maybe we can go from Floyd Town? Got the Pokemon League there. Lots of like check out at some point. Uh, yo, so I took a break from the hot springs to have some hot chocolate. I could have some tea, but you know, chocolate just tastes better. We should try some. I do love hot chocolate, man. Hot chocolate is the best. Uh, what you got? Fresh water, mustard, beer. No hot chocolate, unfortunately. All right, what else can we do? Uh, yo, imagine having to play a Pokemon fan game. Or worse, having to translate one. <laughs> oh, it must take a long time to translate, man. Is that a special? Oh no, we've spoken to you, haven't we? All right, what house have we not gone into? For like this side? Uh, you're wondering why I'm wearing my cap backwards? I don't know, because it's fashion, you know? Never in my life have I worn a cap backwards. I feel like I couldn't pull it off. Alright, uh, we've got this house over here's gotta be... Yeah, the gym. Uh, nothing in the bin there. So we'll go check out the right side, then we'll come back. Oh, a visit! Uh, are you collecting all the Quintilla's badges? I have a daughter who was very fond of Pokemon battles. 
Unfortunately, we had several problems with her and in the end, well, she's no longer at home. I wonder if she's okay. Hopefully she'll be back soon. Oh, are you training Pokemon? Good, good. It's something that helps young people a lot in learning responsibility. Taking care of your Pokemon or traveling alone, it's a lot of responsibility. It's a great experience. People change that during their travels and learn many things. So who's your daughter? Right, uh, and I think around there. Ooh, what's this? Uh, what is this place? May look like I'm slacking off, but that's a lie. Come here on my breaks to hate my job more. Work to live, not live to work. Fair. Uh-huh. I think one day I should set course for my destiny. I've always wanted to be a mailman. Deliver a mail sounds great, but people laugh at me. Oops. Uh, hey, fancy game of poker brisket? No, I'm good. I used to be an internet freak until this uh, talking cat appeared. Damn it, now what can I do to get my fame back? <laughs> uh, hi. Hey, do you want to buy a washing machine for the modest price of $10,000? You can have it. Yeah, sure. Got a, I've got a washing machine. Here, a washing machine. Brand new, of course. What does it even do? <laughs> um, the power's electrical movement that is used consecutively, but the effect is lost if another movement is used. Okay. Now, this girl next, next door is a real machine. Don't you see how she steals washing machines? I believe she recently got a new one. In addition, they work very well. Highly recommended. <laughs> what do I do in my life? I'm watching TV. Dude, the TV's not even on. Um, access to this room is restricted. I'm cleaning it. Okay. Then we can come back later on. Right. Uh, so let's go and get the gym badge. I'm just all checking. Like, I'm not going... Yeah, I can go south. Okay. So once we get the gym badge, we go south. Let's go and do this. Hopefully not too difficult. Uh, yo. Good morning, young challenger. Welcome to Eminemcia and Dogen's gym. Uh, those two trainers have the best teamwork in all of Quintellus. In order to overcome their hot attacks and icy defense, you'll need your Pokemon to work together. Their fighting style is like a synchronized dance. You have to dance to the sound of their attacks. So, do you want to go, to, go on stage? Yeah, sure. Are we going straight into the battle? Hey, you're already here. I can only really feel the frenzy of your heartbeat. But stop the car. We won't get uh, straight to the point. Dogen, let's talk. Okay. All right. To fight us, you don't just need to be good at battling. You also have to show your skills on the dance floor. Stand to my right. Oh, no. So, all right. You have to uh, beat three opponents. You have to defeat each of them in a dance and in a roaring battle. Oh, should I get ready for the keyboard? Send Nuria in. I'll show you my... Caporia moves. All right, ready, to, ready, set, go. Oh man, uh, I'm not ready for this. All right. This is fine. All right, so far. Not sure how long this is going to go for, but was oh, that it? We good? Hey, last time I had to do that when we um, got the uh, professor's assistant for the drummer. It took so long. Whew. Right, uh, let's flame burst ya. Not bad, not bad. One more flame burst. Hey, Give me that level BB, level 59. Well, Voltsy wins this round. Whew. Round number two. Seem to be doing well. Get ready. Adela doesn't mess around. Let the battle begin. Oh, uh, keyboard again. So I danced the river with my grandmother's pacemaker. Uh, which part? Okay, it's that. Better not stop me. All right, ready, set, go. Ah. Yeah, this is... Oh, man, I'm messing up bad. If this is muted, the audio. Then, you know, it's copyright. If any points, there's like... Either I'm not speaking, or like, there's just... Oh man, no background music, then you know it's just copyright. You're pretty good at rocking. Let's see if you can follow my guitar solo. Alright, I'll try my best. I do love that channel. Uh, start pulse. It's. Oh, Perish Song, okay. Yeah, for a few. Ooh, that kind of sucks. Okay, uh, I'm gonna switch. Oh, I'm not fully healed. I should probably get healed up. That's fine. 
<laughs> I'm hoping once I defeat the next trend, I can just leave and get healed up before we take on the gym leader. If not, then, uh, yeah, it's fine. Well, Voltsy wins this round. Yeah, I do. Way to go, dude. It's time for the last duel. Get ready to flap your wings. All right. One, two, three. One step forward, one step back. Let's move those muscles. All right, ready, set, go. Oh, no, I'm not ready. Oh, holding the control. Oh, no. Um, I'm not in the right bit. Ah. Okay, we're back on it. We're back on it. It's fine. My fingers were not over the keyboard and I missed some stuff, but like, yeah, I think you can probably miss all of that and be absolutely fine. Wow, those are some good steps. Go ahead and let our Pokemon show off their dance. All right, bring it on. Rescue, we'll go full. Raw Veil, that's fine. Wee. <laughs> Nothing. When you like Spiritomb and if it's a double, yeah, double battle, like Cosmomando and Spiritomb can just take them both out, so I'm thinking they're gonna be fire and ice, right? Surely it's got a dark pulse on you, and you're gonna critical hit me. Ah, oh, you're the worst. Please don't speed me. Nice. Yeah, Mama Swipe, please don't speed me again. Nice. Woo! Alright, now it's time for the gym leader, which. Yeah, let me get healed up first. Well, Voltsy wins this round. If I can't get healed up, then I'm going to have to try my best, but very good, Voltsy. Seem to know how to go with the flow. Well, get ready, as Dogen and I are the hottest duo. We'll show our brilliant teamwork. My Pokemon will scorch you with their incandescent power, while Dogen will support me with his powerful blizzards. Voltsy, face our bitey fury. Okay. Let's do this. We only got four Pokemon, so we might be alright. Oh no, we're fully healed! Sick! Oh, that makes life so much easier. Okay, uh. Okay, Shadow Ball and. Going for Thunderbolt? Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Dude, that is like. It really feels like they. The Orangurus are so, like, tanky. Gonna keep attacking to as much as we can. Nice. That crit was really good. Hey, you lowered my speed. Oh, you got a citrus berry? Of course you do. And a full restore. Great. Oh, this is off to a great start, isn't it? Got the special defense job. I'll take that. Right. Uh, Cordion, we can go for Hyper Voice. Hit them both. And this is not good. Oh, we lived, we lived. Let's look at the fuck. Right, uh, I'm gonna heal up. And then go for another hyper voice, and you're gonna full restore again, great. All right, this is, this is annoying. Hopefully you got no more um, full restores. I think I'm gonna go double check and get 200 HP. It's obviously in the new one's 120, isn't it? Make sure we get full HP and then oh you missed that attack, that's good. And you burn me, but it's fine because we have a special and nice good damage, good damage. Gotta go for that full restore. Full restore and then another hyper voice. Hopefully we take you both out this time. Missing the fire spin, nice. Cool. Man, those two are tough. Work really well together, though. Chatter and Mr. Ryan. So we'll go Flame Burst on you, and we'll just Hyper Voice again and Heat Wave. That's not good. Oh, that crit was good. Uh, let's go Crobat, Flame Burst you, and then we Overdrive you. Oh, we got this in the bag. It's fine, it's fine. Just a little chat I'll take out with uh, any other Pokemon we got. Heat Wave, yes, go to Flame Burst. And I'm just gonna go to Leddy and go for a punch. Just, uh, 
Let me take you out. Oh, I thought that'd be enough. I thought that'd be enough, but you avoided the attack anyway. <laughs> Man, that was, uh, yeah. I mean, it was tough at the start, but not bad, but that was awesome. Right, Dogen? Dogen is as impressed as I am. Okay, well, let me see where I put that badge. No, not here. Not in this pocket either. Hey, Dogen, the badge disappeared. Don't you have one in your pocket? We forgot the badge at the club. So what do you say you take a little spin and come to our abode? It's close to the entrance. Just go straight ahead to the east. It's impossible to miss. Well, we already went in there, didn't we? But uh, come on, Dogen. We'll wait for vaults here at D DDBs. Alright. Well, I think it's a very great place to end this pod off. Let's get healed up. And... Oh, wait. Samira's there. So it's her house then. That's what we spoke to her mum and dad, but... Are you spying on me again? Anyway, what's the difference? This one here is my home. Well, it was until they kicked me out. I've been, uh, I've been having addiction problems for a long time. I mean, betting and all that. I was always wasting all my money on things like that. Well, and I keep, I keep losing it, but it's just, I can't help it. It's always that allure of earning more and more. In the end, I end up spending my parents' money and the snowball got bigger and bigger. And well, you can imagine what happened. It's been a year or so since it all crashed down on me. Anyway, I don't even know why I'm telling you. You were listening before, didn't you? I guess uh, you've heard what Faye said, but I don't have the strength to see my parents. I'm still the same as ever and still obsessing about stupid things. Look at me. Now I'm obsessed with beating you in a Pokemon battle when I've always been pretty much a sucker for the whole world of Pokemon. You faced Emanesia and Dogen, didn't you? Fighting you reminds me of playing with them and Faye a few years ago. It's absurd, but I don't know. Uh, you fight with the same intensity as those three. Anyway, I'll see you later. I bet you, uh, I'll beat you, so keep winning until that day. All right, I mean, I'll try. Anyway, as I was saying, I'll catch you guys next time. Well, we'll go and get our gym badge, and I think we'll be heading south. And then uh, I might see if I can look into maybe trying to do these other side quests we've potentially missed as well. So I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.